welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Jana. thank you so much for stopping by and taking the time out of your day to watch this video so today we are comparing all of these card holders one second these brands include kate spade coach chanel and louis vuitton so i will show you what I usually put inside of these card holders, another option, and which one I think is the best. So grab a snack, grab a drink, and let's go! So let's start off with Chanel. I can fit five cards in here comfortably, um, but of course you can fit more than five and put some more in the middle if you'd like. I'm just showing you what I normally fit in here because I don't want to stretch out the leather. Some people fit a lot more than five cards and you can also double up the card slots if you would like as well. You can see that the Canadian cash doesn't stick out which is my absolute favorite thing about this card holder because I don't like seeing my bills and I don't like folding it more than once. For American bills, you will have no problem fitting it inside of the card holder. So next up is Coach. There's six card slots, so of course you can have six cards cards inside the slots. The main compartment gets really, really stiff after you fit all those cards in there. So you probably can only fit one more bill in there or maybe one card. You really have to compromise because I've had this for two or more years now and it hasn't really stretched out too, too much. So it might be a little bit difficult to kind of put more than one card in the main compartment when you have all six in the front already. And of course, the Canadian cash doesn't stick out because it's the same height as the Chanel. So I absolutely love it. So the Chanel and the Coach card holders are the most comparable in size. The Chanel one is just a little bit longer, which makes it a bit easier to take your cards out because it is a little bit more malleable and more stretchy especially because mine is lambskin that can easily be stretched out so you do have to be more careful with putting cards in it so that's why I only put five cards in here so next up is Louis Vuitton and this one does look a little bit bigger for some reason but I did check their website and compared it with their other card holders and this one is exactly the same size so if you were thinking about other like this other style in the Louis Vuitton this is the same size as those ones you can fit five cards comfortably um, for me I don't like doubling up the card slots because I did see that it started to stretch so the Canadian cash does stick out because it is shorter than the coach and the Louis Vuitton one yeah this is the Louis Vuitton one now moving on to Kate Spade so these are the smallest of the bunch I have two this one's the dark pink this one is the light pink and the dark pink fits a bit more than the light pink I've had this one for a little bit longer so this one fits six cards in here and the Canadian cash does stick out, but the American one doesn't. This one has stretched out. If you want the Kate Spade ones, it can definitely be stretched out. But I've had the Kate, this other light pink Kate Spade one for a really long time now as well. But this one hasn't stretched out. I've had these for years and years now, and only this one has stretched out. So I don't know what's wrong with this one. I mean, maybe I'm just not using it as much as the other one. So this light pink one only fits four cards and some cash. Of course, it is exactly the same size as the other one. So I wanted to show you one more like card holder alternative and it is this one. This is the Louis Vuitton key pouch or clay. Obviously it is a different style than one of these card holders. You can see the difference. This one has a zipper and this one just has the card slots. I wanted to include this because this might be a better alternative or option for you. This fits 12 cards comfortably you can stretch it out i have 12 cards in here right now there's still some room in here and you can still fit a bunch more cards in here for the cash you have to fold it more than once which i really don't like to do but you gotta do what you gotta do i still love this so so much not only does this fit cards but it also fits coins 
some other things you want to fit in there and it's just very very versatile so if you want to just like check out different reviews just search it up on YouTube because there's so many good reviews just talking about the versatility in here like I've put some bobby pins hair ties lip balm in here and it is great <laughs> So like I said, this is the most versatile, but obviously you came here for a card holder comparison, but this still might be a better option for you. Okay, so now let me tell you which one is better value for money. I'm going to compare three different options. So I'm going to compare the Coach with the Chanel because they are the most comparable right now. I wanted to show you which one I think is better value for money. Um, so of course I love, love, love the Chanel one, but if you don't want to spend the money on this, the Coach one takes the cake, okay? This Coach card holder is honestly so awesome. The leather is so buttery and so smooth. I absolutely love it. There are different leathers and colors to choose from. But if I were you, pro tip right now, for the coach, definitely get the smooth leather because it is just way more soft and silky than their other leathers. Like their pebbled leather is not great. I haven't had too many scratches or anything on mine. So. But of course, if you want to spend your money, of course the Chanel one. I love it. It's just timeless and it's classic and it's Chanel, you know, like you can't argue with Chanel. <laughs> okay, now comparing Chanel with Louis Vuitton, okay? I feel like these two are always like head to head. They're like, should I go for Chanel or should I, should I go for Louis Vuitton? Or it's either Chanel or the YSL one because they are most comparable and that one is just a lot cheaper than the Chanel one. Going back to Chanel and Louis Vuitton, which one would I rather get? Would I rather get the Louis Vuitton one or Chanel? I would rather get Louis Vuitton actually. So let me tell you why. It's just cheaper and less worrisome. So obviously, I went if you went with caviar leather because this one is lambskin with Chanel, you probably won't have this problem. But I just don't really like the feel of Chanel caviar because every time I feel it, it just feels very, very dry and like really textured and I just don't like it. So I am a lambskin girl. I mean, maybe one day I will find a caviar that is shiny and soft and smooth. And that uh, maybe I'll dream about that day. But for now, I love lambskin. So because Louis Vuitton is canvas, you don't have to worry about scratches. And especially now with like hand sanitizing so much and just wiping down everything you touch basically, this is just a better option because I don't have to worry about like alcohol kind of like spilling over this. I'm just more comfortable with wiping down canvas rather than a leather piece. And because this one is canvas, I can just throw this into my bag um, and I don't have to really worry about it. Now I do have to worry about the color transfer because at the back here I do have a few spots for of color transfer already. But if you did have like their other canvases, you will have no problem with color transfer. So now I'm going to compare Louis Vuitton with Louis Vuitton. Now since I said I would choose this one over the Chanel one, that doesn't mean I'm going to choose this one over this one. I would definitely choose this one over this card holder. Why? It's just more useful. It's more versatile. You can fit more cards in there. You can put coins in there. You can fit cash in there. You can hook your keys in there. You can hook this into your bag. Like there's just so many possibilities with this one rather than this one. So although I picked this one as the winner of this video, um, I still can't live without any of my card holders that I just mentioned. I love that I can switch these out whenever I want, whenever I can. If I'm too tired of one of them or I just want to give one of them a break. Anyways, that concludes my video. I hope you found this a little bit helpful. If you have any other questions, feel free to comment down below or message me on Instagram. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye!